Today, the internal combustion engine is used in motorcycles, automobiles, boats, trucks, aircraft, ships, heavy-duty machinery and powered generators. A four-stroke engine is an internal combustion engine in which the piston completes four separate strokes, intake, compression, power, and exhaust during two separate revolutions of the engine's crankshaft, and one single thermodynamic cycle. Let's take a look at the basic internal parts of a four-stroke engine. Inside the engine block, there is a crankshaft. Piston rods are attached to crankshaft. Pistons are attached to the piston's rods. As the crankshaft turns, it causes the lifter to make each piston move up and down. At the top of the crankshaft there is a camshaft which is connected to the crankshaft by a timing belt. While the crankshaft is making the pistons move up and down, the camshaft is turning making the valves to open and close. Let's now take a look at how the combustion creates pistons motion. First, intake stroke. The inlet valve is opened, and the fuel-air mixture is drawn in, as the piston travels down. Second, compression stroke. The inlet valve is closed, and the piston travels back up the cylinder, compressing the fuel-air mixture. Just before piston reaches the top of its compression stroke, a spark plug emits a spark, to combust the fuel-air mixture. Third, combustion stroke. The piston is now forced down by the pressure wave of the combustion, of the fuel-air mixture. The engine's power is derived, from this cycle. Fourth, exhaust stroke. The exhaust valve is opened, and the piston travels back up, expelling the exhaust gases through the exhaust valve. At the top of the stroke the exhaust valve is closed. This process is repeated. What had been presented, is the cycle of operation of one cylinder, of a four-stroke engine. Generally engines have two or more cylinders acting in concert with each other to produce the engine power. 